Good morning, everybody. <clears throat> Happy almost Memorial weekend. Happy Friday. I know you might be looking for Shanae, but today you get me. <laughs> um, my name is Jenny Serta. I think some of you probably know me. Um, I live in Boise, where today I'm sitting on my patio. It's supposed to be like 70 degrees and sunny. The perfect start to summer vacation. Yesterday was our last day of school here. Um, I know some folks are still going into a little bit earlier in June. Hi, Jennifer. Um, but we are done. So my son celebrated by staying up until midnight playing video games. Who's with me? Your kid's doing the same thing. He would like to do that every night all summer. We have different plans, so let's see how that goes. <laughs> Anyways, I want to keep this kind of short. I know Shanae always pops in and gives us a really good recap of the week and kind of tells us what we can push for um, bef you know, before this week's promotions end and then gives us a good setup for um, next week. And so I want to, um, she, uh, she of course set me up with a great list of talking points. <laughs> so I will not disappoint you with any of the Jenny sort of wisdom. I will share some tidbits from Jenny, but mostly Shanae has done a great job of setting us up. Um, so <clears throat> clarify is, um, on sale for $30 right now ends tomorrow. So if you haven't reached out to people to have them you know, following up on a sample maybe that you sent them, um, or maybe they bought this a couple months ago and they need a refill. Now is a really good time to get your Clarify on sale. I love that we can pretty much always have a sale to promote to our clients. My clients really appreciate that too when I, when I know what they like, what their favorite products are, and I remind them that there's a sale, and, and I know they really just appreciate that kind of personal touch. So if you ever hesitate to reach out with a sale, don't, because I mean, when you feel great about someone that you know, like this is just a crazy example, but my friend um, Amy was shopping a couple weeks ago and we just got a new puppy and when she was out and about she found oh my gosh she found a cute hoodie I know dogs don't need hoodies I mean maybe you're in the other camp where you think dogs do need hoodies but anyways she found a cute hoodie on sale for a great price that she thought our puppy needed and she reached out and let me know and I was like oh she's on vacation and she's thinking about me you know so it's the same kind of thing when you have a good relationship with your clients when you're friends with them and you care about what's going on in their life and then you reach out and say <clears throat> your favorite face wash is on sale I just wanted to let you know here's a link to make it easy if, you, if you're ready for a refill easy helpful great for your business and then I don't know if you guys saw, but Jesse popped in with a couple of pow pow, really extra bonuses. Hi, Jen, um, to help us finish the week strong. So we've got Calm. <clears throat> it's on sale today and tomorrow for $28. Make sure I got that right. Yes, $28. And then also, when you spend $99, you get this little cutie. I love this thing. If you haven't seen it yet, like in person, I know you've seen it. It's beautiful, right? But then, um, like it's significant. Like when you pick it up, you can tell it's like, it's like the real deal. It's not, you know, something cheap throwaway. It is like a beautiful tool that's going to be great for rubbing your eye cream in, dipping in there and getting something out of a tube so you can put it on your face without getting bacteria in your products. Um, free with a $99 purchase. So pick up your favorite face wash on sale, grab a moisturizer, a couple other gifts for graduates or mother, Mother's Day is gone, Father's Day, whatever's going on, baby showers, you know, it's the season of celebrations. And then you can get one of these for free. Um, all right, what else? Also, um, I don't know if you had a chance to check out Sarah's Power Half Hour. She gave a great overview of what our aligned committees are doing. So we've got the Diversity and Equity. I might not say the names exactly right. Um, the Diversity and Equity Committee. They're doing some cool stuff. We also have the Ingredients and Products Committee. And then we have the Training and Marketing Committee. So she gave really nice updates about what everybody is doing. And I have to say personally, I love that... Um, like it's, we're just all kind of in this together. We really have a voice, which I appreciate so much because there's so much wisdom in the field. And I love that our, our leadership at Align just embraces that and we're working together. So check that out with Sarah. And you know, Sarah is always a hoot. So she's a lot of fun to just hang out with and, and like hear her uh, stream of consciousness wisdom from that big brain of hers. 
Um, also, something that I, I don't, I hope you all have been noticing. Um, <clears throat> Jennifer has been posting Thirsty Thursday posts. And it's such a great, like, it's like featuring a product and talking about all the ways you can share it. So helpful um, that you can kind of take that, make it your own, and use that to reach out to your clients. Um, I love also, I mean, this is one of the things that Align really does better than any place else that I know of. Just collaboration. Like, we don't need to re reinvent the wheel every single time, you know, we go out to talk to a client or create a post or you know, anything like that. We have got great resources, right? In we've got Jennifer's Thirsty Thursdays. We've got our whole ARD. We've got so much great stuff. So make sure you're turning in on Thirsty Thursdays in the Align um, Ambassador Group and and uh, just soak up all that wisdom and then just use that and make it your own. No need to just um, get stuck trying to figure out something new and creative. She has taken care of that for you. Such good stuff. All right, so we're heading into a holiday weekend. I hope you guys have some rest and relaxation and um, some good things planned. Um, <clears throat> just to let you know, making sure I don't miss anything, um, the, the preliminary calendar for June, <laughs> it's almost June, will come on the 26th, which is Sunday. So that's our weekly email that we get every week. And so the calendar for June will be in there, and it'll also be in the Ambassador Resource Drive under May for now until June arrives and then it'll be in the June folder. Um, so make sure you check it out and just kind of, I like to give it a look and, and I don't necessarily have to do anything right then, but as I look at it, if I have some ideas that pop into my head immediately, I might jot those down. But then I don't know about you, but I'd like to let things marinate in here. Um, so let it, get it in there. Think about what's up, coming up for the next month and um, start kind of letting your brain subconsciously think about what, how you might be able to use those um, promotions and specials and things that we're doing to really keep your business thriving over the summer and try to think of ways to keep it <clears throat> easy for you because your clients are not the only ones that have fun and busy summer. I had a coffee with one of my um, girlfriends yesterday. Her son and my son are in the same grade. And she was like going through her calendar. Like, I'm not going to see her until at the end of July. Because <laughs> they're doing something every single week, pretty much. Uh, and a lot of people are doing that. They're just disconnecting a little bit. They've earned it. It's been a busy school year. It's summer. It's the time for vacationing. So keep it simple for you and keep it simple for your clients um, when you're planning for June. Um, also, let's see. A line will be closed on Memorial Day. So don't forget about that. You can go ahead and still send in any support requests or things like that, but they'll be taken care of Tuesday when everybody gets back to the office. Office. Um, all right, so one sneak peek for next week is that Refresh is going to be our product of the week, our POW, and it's going to be on sale for $20. Now, Refresh, oh, I should have brought that out here. Um, Refresh is the perfect summer product. <clears throat> it's easy to take on the go. We have, um, we actually went camping already once kind of this year, so I threw some in the camper when I was kind of prepping because uh, it's so good for just dry summer skin. It's great on a sunburn. It's relaxing and fun and easy to do. Comes in those little like single serving containers so you don't have to take the whole big box. Just throw a couple in your camper or in your camping tote, which is what I always used to have before we got a camper, um, or in your swim bag or whatever um, you take with you so that you have something really refreshing and fun um, to use when summer sucks all the moisture out of you <laughs> or gives you a little burn or your kids get a little burn. It's such gentle, nice, hydrating product um, that will um, help everybody feel happy and healthy and take the sting out of the summer heat and sun. So that's going to be on sale for $20 um, starting on Sunday. So, <clears throat> all right. So one idea that I have that I want to share, just like a little training tip, something that you might be able to do to keep it easy over the summer, but still keep people kind of engaged in your business, would be to think about using um, your Stars Rewards um, 
if you have some stars rewards, which probably most of us do, um, one really good way to put those to use without having to put any more out of your pocket, you can use those rewards to reward your clients for shopping with you directly. Um, I try to do my rewards for people who are shopping my website, especially this time of year, because I'm on the go, they're on the go, um, they can grab their phone any time of the day or night, they can place an order, it ships right to them. Easy for them, easy for me. Um, and that way we can all kind of do things on the go, which is what we want to do this summer, so we can be out having fun. You could do, um, you could do uh, an entry for every order placed, you could do an entry for every $20 spent, um, you could, and you can incentivize it in whatever way you want. You could do something where they get an entry for sharing a review about one of your products that they love on social media and tagging you. Um, they could get an entry into your prize drawing for uh, referring a new client. Um, lots of different things you can incentivize. Not all of them require a purchase. You could just focus on purchasing to keep your um, ambassador volume up over the summer months, but that, you know, look, take a look at your business, see where you want to incentivize behavior and focus on that. And then you can use your stars. You can use it for something like buying the Aura Gold and eye masks, which I'm just kind of looking like I need. <laughs> um, Should have done that before I got on, huh guys? Um, <clears throat> but you get a package of Aura, you get five of the golden eye masks, and then you can drop them in the mail. They are really cheap to mail and send out. You could award five prizes and really touch at five of your clients in a really fun way. Um, you could um, buy some of the refresh pod masks and share those. That will give you 10 individual prizes. Um, or you can do something like uh, the winner gets a $25 shopping spree on your website or whatever, you know, whatever you have in stars um, that you are able to use without putting money out of your pocket to incentivize people to stay engaged with your business and um, be uh, aligning with you all summer long. So you could do something, sometimes when I have a really big event, I'll even say, I'm gonna give away a red light wand and then here's how you get your entries. This would be like, you know, this is at the high end of things. So that, that doesn't have to be this, but if you have enough stars and you think you can get enough engagement to merit spending them on something like that, the red light wand is something people will engage for because it's something that's a little pricier. And so people might not feel like they should splurge on it for themselves, but they're willing to buy their favorite face wash for an entry maybe. Um, I'm so sorry guys, I'm in my backyard and in the alley is the trash truck. So, sorry for the loud noise. I don't know if you can hear it or not, but it's very loud. Um, <clears throat> anyway, so these are some ideas. So you could do anything from sending a golden aura face mask, which is really affordable, wouldn't take too many in stars, really affordable to mail and reaches five different people, all the way up to going up to like a really grand prize and you could even have that span over June and July if you want to just keep the engagement going. You could do that and you could also do some secondary prizes. Like be creative with it and have some fun. Use your rewards so it doesn't have to be out of pocket expenses. And also keep in mind making it easy for you. One of the reasons I really like to reward people for shopping my website is because I have a handy dandy report. At the end of the month, I can download everybody who shopped, I can see what they spent, and that tells me how many entries they get. Um, if you add some other things, there's a little tracking to do, not that it's gonna be super difficult, but um, just keep in mind that you wanna make something doable, something that you'll be able to keep track of easily, something that allows you to live the summer that you're trying to live as well. All right, so that is my little training tip of the day. Um, thank you guys so much for tuning in. I'm sorry you didn't get to see Sinead's beautiful face, but <laughs> I know I always look forward to her wrap-ups. They're such great, useful information, a good way to reconnect on a Friday before a weekend. And so I appreciated her reaching out and giving me a chance to do this week's um, wrap-up and setup for next month, uh, or next weekend, next month, I guess. We're getting there. Um, all right, you guys, have a great Friday. Have a great weekend. Enjoy your um, 
your Monday off with Memorial Weekend. I hope that you get a chance to relax and enjoy um, some time with people that you love or maybe not, maybe alone time, whatever brings you joy. I hope that's what this weekend brings you. You guys take care. Bye.